Okay, so I wanted to uh, show you guys a tutorial on how to uh, get through the uh, new uh, calculate direction uh, thing uh, on version 4.21 uh, on Blueprint uh, for the new animation Blueprint. It's because uh, when I've uh, watched the tutorials uh, how to finish the animations, if you want to check out the link uh, to that uh, video, you can... Uh, go down to the description and find the link below uh, the video and you can watch it uh, but uh, for version 4.21 they changed uh, calculate direction which uh, got me stuck there but I'm going to show you guys how to get through this now for the animation all you have to do is just uh, right click uh, anywhere right here anything, anywhere in particular so you go into animation and you type and you click on animation blueprint uh, well I'm not gonna click on this because I already have the animation blueprint and uh, you just uh, double click on it and uh, now uh, I have uh, worked on this uh, so you just uh, type in walk run uh, for the state machine uh, and then you uh, go through the entry and then you do the documentation for idle and the documentation for walk and run uh, so I'm just gonna go on idle and uh, show you guys uh, what I mean by that uh, well I'm just gonna work uh, on uh, the uh, part when I got stuck uh, so go into the event graph uh, there's an example that I'm gonna do now I left these uh, two nods out because uh, those are the uh, original nods uh, that those were already there for by default uh, but I'm just gonna show you guys how you get through this now you uh, cl hold click on this and then you drag the thing out that looks like the wire because it looks like a wire in my opinion then you let go to place the nod and you type in sequence and then you click on sequence that's how you do that. And then now you uh, click uh, on this pin and then you drag it out to the end of the wire, like where the wire is going to go. So you type it cast a character or cast two character, if I would say, but I call it cast a character. Okay, but just call it whatever you want or just call it what the uh, nod actually says. Okay, now that you. Uh, place to cast a character you can now s connect the blue wires from uh, try to get pawn owner to uh, cast a character but uh, you can add but uh, you're gonna add more blue wires so you drag out uh, like this then you place uh, the end of the wire right there and then type in get velocity then you uh, do the same thing uh, except uh, I would suggest uh, going down and then you type in get actor rotation and there you go uh, now uh, you uh, click over here and then you drag it to create a yellow wire and then you let go then you type in calculate direction well before that uh, now I want to show you guys what I mean uh, when I got stuck here now, this is the part uh, that I got stuck uh, without noticing uh, that uh, calculate direction uh, has been changed uh, from the past to the present uh, so what I'm gonna do is uh, try to uh, hold that hold from there and then you create a wire and then you let go and then type in calculate direction uh, there is no calculate direction. It was just, uh, just nothing. So what I've done is uh, try right click on this uh, blueprint uh, graph, and then you uh, type in the calculate direction, and you can still use it. And what a surprise! There is no connector for the white wires, uh, which means you'll have to do something different. So, but you can. Uh, connect the yellow and uh, I wouldn't call them lavender wires uh, yeah yellow and lavender wires uh, but uh, you uh, 
can uh, just uh, start off by uh, creating another lavender wire and then you type in vector. Okay, no, that's not it. The yellow wire, actually. Uh, sorry for the mess up. Uh, vector length uh, squared. Uh, that's uh, what you're supposed to do. Uh, then you uh, go right here and then you type in set direction and then you uh, connect the uh, green wires uh, and then uh, you uh, click uh, and then drag the wires out to uh, add set speed and you do like this and uh, there it is uh, the uh, new way of uh, finishing the animation the blueprint uh, so now Let's see what happens when you click on compile. And voila! It worked! Uh, it worked just fine! Just fine! Just fine! I should get a gold medal for this. <laughs> or a golden trophy. Uh, for this, so let's just go ahead and exit that out. And then we click play. And it worked! It worked just fine. So it was just uh, there if anybody just got stuck uh, on uh, calculate direction. Uh, I was just uh, going to give an example of uh, how uh, someone got stuck on uh, calculate direction. Uh, like for me when I used to try to finish the uh, animations. Uh, but uh, it was a pain in the butt uh, to... Uh, experience uh, the change of uh, calculate direction uh, from the past uh, to this uh, version but uh, once you uh, experience that enough uh, you'll get used to the uh, updated uh, versions uh, for anything in particular so yeah that's uh, all I want to do is just to show you guys how to work on the new calculate direction update so hopefully this uh, will help you guys out uh, if you have any uh, comments uh, just let me know and I'll try to reply to them.